lovely people of the internet, my name is Savannah and today I am here to tell you some things that you probably don't even want to know about me. But who cares, I'm going to tell you anyway! Welcome to the Too Much Information tag. You're welcome. What are you wearing? Clothes. Underwear. Ever been in love? Yeah, well, at least I thought I was. And moving on. Had a terrible breakup. Yes, and moving on. How tall? I'm like five even on a good day. I'm really short. How much do you weigh? Is that even something you should ask? Over 100, under 150. Cause I'm little. Do you have any tattoos? Yes, I have two tattoos. I have a play pause button on my foot, um, which if I could get it all the way up here, I would totally show you, but I probably have a picture if not. And then I have my mom's birthday on my back. You can see that. I'm hoping you can see that. Any piercings? Yeah, I have my uh, regular ears pierced. There's just nothing in them right now. And then I have uh, my cartilage on this one ear pierced. My OTP. I ship Carmi pretty hard, and I also ship Emerson. And if you don't know what those ship names are, then you should just probably look it up because I don't want to explain it to you. Favorite TV shows? Definitely Orange is the New Black, American Horror Story, Pretty Little Liars, The Fosters, Switched at Birth, Glee. It's pretty much the rundown. Favorite bands? I have a pretty wide variety of things I listen to, but um, my favorite artists or bands are The Cab, We the Kings, Hoodie Allen, Time Flies, just to name a couple. Something you miss. I really honestly right now miss college uh, since I'm at home. Uh, I go back to college in a few weeks, so I'm just kind of missing people there, friends, just the whole experience itself. Favorite song. Oh man, I just don't have one favorite song. Like I have like a collection of favorite songs, but uh, pretty much No Interruption by Hoodie Allen. <laughs> Beast by Time Flies and Girl from the Kids by the Show. How old are you? I am 19 years old. Qualities you look for in someone else. Honestly, beautiful eyes and a medium-ish height because I'm really short. Zodiac sign. My zodiac sign is Capricorn. I'm a ram thing. Favorite quote. My favorite quote is the brave may not live forever but the cautious never live at all and it's actually on my wall over there. You just can't see it. Favorite actors. Some of my favorite actors or actresses would have to be Naya Rivera, Shay Mitchell, Jennifer Lawrence, Emma Stone, super hilarious people, total girl crushes. Favorite color. If you guys didn't know, this um, room used to be chroma key green or a lime green color, so I would have to say lime green. Loud or soft music? Loud. Go big or go home. Where do you go when you're sad? Straight to the internet, straight to a CTFXD or Shaytard's vlog. All the way. How long do you shower? Uh, it can be anywhere from like 10 minutes to 30 minutes. Uh, it just really honestly depends. Sometimes you get like brainwashed in the shower because you're sitting there and you're like, oh, I should do this and then I should do this. And then you think of like the best ideas in the shower. So you could literally stand there for an hour and not realize it and think it's only like five minutes. Truth. How long does it take you to get ready? I'm a weird person and I like to wake up like super before I have to be somewhere. So if it's like in the morning, I gotta wake up like an hour and a half. With even whether it takes me five minutes to get ready or 30 minutes to get ready, I just, I have to mentally prepare myself for the day ahead of me and the clothes I'm about to put on and the teeth I'm about to brush. So I mean, it could take me anywhere from five minutes to 30 minutes to get ready, depending on whether I'm wearing gym shorts and a t-shirt to go work out or I have to get dressed up to go to like something important. Ever been in a physical fight? Yes and no. In third grade, this girl punched me in the stomach and then I cried. Yup. And then I've had to break up a fight before, so I've had to pull someone off of someone, but I've never physically, like, thrown a punch, because, you know, nobody wants none of this. Turn-ons. Confidence, intelligence, honesty, and if your eyeballs and your head are just, like, beautiful, then you hook, line, sinker, got it, turn-offs. Smoking, drugs cockiness. What's your reason for joining YouTube? The reason I joined YouTube is because uh, I did a lot of school projects back in like middle school up into high school and I just kind of wanted to put them somewhere to like look back at them myself and like watch them and maybe send them to a friend or something like that and then it just kind of like and did change into this. What's your biggest fear? Clowns. Last thing that made you cry. I, I will admit, I am a crier. I mean, I will watch a sad commercial, I'll tear up. I will watch a sad movie, I will shed tears. I cried and sobbed through half of John Green's The Fault in Our Stars. I mean, I, 
I cry at some things, I'll be honest. So the last time I cried, uh, I was watching the, <laughs> you're gonna think this story is really funny, but I was watching the, uh, the Kids' Choice Sport Awards that they just had on Nickelodeon, and this kid made a half-court uh, shot to win $50,000, and it just made me tear up, because I was like, that kid gets to go to college, and like he doesn't have to worry about like having to pay for it, and it just made me like, <sighs> and it just, it got to me. Last time you said you love someone. I told my mom today on the phone that I loved her. What's the meaning behind your YouTube name? So I'm sure a bunch of you guys probably don't know this, but I made this channel with a friend. So like both of us were on the channel. And so the S in SAC Productions 101 stands for Savannah. And then the A stands for an and, and the C stands for her name, which is Catherine. And then productions. And then when we made our YouTube channel in 2009, I mean, Numbers were awesome to have in your username, so like 101, and I just didn't change it. So I am forever branded. What's the last book you read? The last book I read uh, was The Fault in Our Stars by John Green. Uh, I don't really have a whole lot of time to read. I love to read, just like with school and all that kind of good stuff. Like, I just kind of get overpassed, and I read that last December. So, what are you currently reading? Currently, I'm reading the last book in the Divergent trilogy, so Allegiant. What's the last show you watched? The last show I watched uh, was Big Brother last night with my mom. The last person you talked to? The last person I talked to probably was my dad, because I brought him Chick-fil-A, and we ate it, so. What's the relationship with the last person you texted? Well, let's take a look at my handy dandy telephono right here, and so my mom texted me K. So, that's my mom. What's your favorite food? Pizza! What's the place you want to visit? I really want to visit pretty much anywhere in Europe and or Australia. Um, I want to go to like London and maybe Scotland and like see all of those cool things that they have to see over here that we don't have in America. Because sometimes America's boring and we want to see Europe, but we can't because Europe's expensive and you have to take a plane to get to Europe. and. Planes are also expensive, and then what if that plane crashes, and then you're lost forever, and then you turn into the uh, series of Lost, and... Yep. The last place you were. Well, the last place I was, I was sitting over at my desk, and then I moved over here to film a video, but before that I was in the living room, and then before that I was in the car. Do you have a crush? Nope. Not really. Last time you kissed someone. Oh, God this past summer? We'll just leave it at that. Last time you were insulted. All the time. It's the internet. Favorite flavor of candy? Literally, I don't like chocolate because it makes me sick. Um, so pretty much I'll eat anything that is red or pink and tastes like watermelon, strawberries, cherries, or something like that. And I only eat the orange Skittles because I'm weird. Do you play any instruments? Nope, not that talented. Favorite piece of jewelry? My favorite piece of jewelry is probably either my class ring Right here, didn't have it on at the moment. And, or, um, one of my watches. This is my G-Shock watch, so. Had to be one of those. Last sport you played? Softball. Duh. Last song you sang? Yeah, Definitely I'm earlier, so before I filmed this video, I was totally okay. jamming out to No One Ryan by the Hour. Talk about the women and the money guy. Favorite pickup line? Do you like pizza? Cause I want a piece of that ass. Have you ever used it? Nope, I can't say I have, except maybe that one time. Last time you hung out. I babysit every day, so I like chill and party with like the seven year olds. Um, but I had dinner with a friend like a week ago. Who should answer these next? All of you guys out there! So thank you guys so much for watching. Probably the weirdest video I've ever put on the internet itself. And for um, listening to things you probably never wanted to know about me, but now you know! So there, if you like this video, definitely give it a like and I'll make some more tags like this. Definitely remember to subscribe and also check out all my social media links down below. I'm really glad uh, you guys watched this video, even though you probably didn't want to know any of these things about me. But other than that, I will see you guys Tuesday with a brand new video coming your way real soon. So stay tuned for that and bye. Okay, I don't really mean to be superficial. I don't want to talk about the women and the money I got. Getting beautiful women is not the issue because the women only come in when the money is high. I'd rather be living my dream than be living a lie.